fourth encounter night of Shiloh, 22 Bishop David Oyedepo preached a sermon on the covenant of abundance a believer has with Jesus Christ. He declared what he said God told him about prosperity after a period of fasting with some books by Kenneth and Gloria Copland. God said my prosperity plan is not a promise. It has no respect for fasting. My prosperity plan is a covenant until your part is played. I am not committed to play my part, he said. He explained that the covenant of abundance is driven on the platform of giving and receiving. He lamented that many Christians are suffering from spiritual constipation. They have acquired so much and they have not given out any. He explained that no matter how fervent you are, you would not get blessed if you refuse to obey God by giving. He then narrated the story of a lady who had it in her heart to give. He shared that this lady came to his office because she made a vow that she would give him the first one million naira she would ever get. When she came to his office, he told her to tell him her story. According to him, she was an orphan and a man who she called a pastor gave her a million naira to start up something for herself. But because she had made this vow, she came to redeem it. I took the money, blessed it that it would increase in her hands and sold it back to her. God did not send her to me to collect, no, he sent her to me to bless her, he said. What I thought on this, share them in the comments, be blessed, and uh, ensure you subscribe to our channel, do well to share this report across all news platforms, thanks and God bless, alright, let's look at the comment section now. Uh, Nasidi Sabo, the uh, commenter saying, uh, but you recently prophesied that someone in your congregation is about to give you one million dollars. And this one we are talking about is one million, uh, one million naira, not one million dollars. So, how does one million naira, you know, uh, connect to one million dollars? Okay. And I think uh, what uh, the pastor did is the best, uh, collecting one million naira from um, uh, an orphan who uh, before now vowed to give one million naira to the church, and uh, after getting it, uh, even though she's not she's not that rich, she decided to bring it to the church. But uh, I think Oyedepo, you know, uh, have some level of pity on her. Because she she's an orphan and uh, she has a lot to do with the money and uh, he uh, thereby so the one million naira into the life of uh, the orphan and uh, as it is as the orphan uses the money she will be growing while Oyedepo as well and his church will be growing. Okay, I think that is the best uh, thing Oyedepo has done. And uh, uh, what are your thoughts? What are your opinions regarding this? Uh, well, let's look, stay, be looking at the comment section. Uh, Francis here did reply to Nasidi saying, um, Don't mind him, pretenders. Don't mind him, pretenders. Then plus two theory here did reply uh, saying, uh, uh, You are not serious. Uh, Francis, a Muslim that doesn't know anything spiritual is judging a pastor very wrongly and you are supporting him. My God, rescue your soul. Okay? Then, uh, having more replies here, uh, stay tuned. Under here, it says that I will do more than that soon. So, stop the mock. I'm a member of his ministry, but 
I will do what God has put in my heart to do. That's why I'm not working a living, but working for a giving. You getting the point, men of God are not your mates. Don't let the devil destroy you and leave you behind. Give no place to the devil. Okay? Give no place to the devil. The Bible wants you. Okay? Give no space to the devil. The Bible wants you. Okay? Ephesus Bricks here also did commented. Let's see. Let's see what Ephesus is saying. First of says a Boko Haram child, Boko Haram child, okay. Then another reply here from or comment here from Una Una Shineku says a God please save us from the hand of these thieves called pastors. Choma okay KD reply to Una here says a be careful what you say so you don't lay cause on yourself okay uh, she need do emmanuel here says uh, mind your thought think before you talk okay that kind of she need do emmanuel uh, 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 in reply to una she comments okay then a choice here says, uh, I'm very sure that you just read the news, headline, but not at all. May God forgive you for your wrong statements, okay? is also a reply to Una Shineku. And here says, uh, be careful from uh, Shooks, be careful, okay? Then uh, also to... Canon more says, uh, Oh God, by your mercy, open the eyes of your children and give them understanding. Amen. Ayodele Oluwole Adebanjo says, uh, It is clearly written in the Bible that my people perish because they lack knowledge. Okay. Shooks. Omoeko says uh, you are a good leader. You are a good leader. Franklin here also did a uh, uh, comment uh, saying uh, refused with good reason. Respecting God's instruction to him to pray on that money for that woman in order to give that woman and her family solid financial background. What bad about that? It, it's instead worthy of emulation. And this is all we can take for now. Thanks and God bless. And share, subscribe to our channel and share this report across all uh, news platforms. As well as share this report across all uh, winners, chapel, uh, platforms, uh, groups, worldwide on Facebook, Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, and uh, name it. And bye for now, please, okay?